Hi guys! Today we're going to see how to request the payment of a fee to all users that want to participate in an online auction created with our YIP Auctions by WooCommerce plugin. Many online auctions platforms ask their users to pay a small fee in order to participate in the auctions and bid for the item they're interested in. Our plugin has this option and we're going to see how it works and how to configure it. Before we get into it, let me remind you, of course, to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and hit that bell down below so that you know every time we have a new video for you. Now, let's get to it. Okay, so with our plugin, you can enable an option to request users to pay a fee in order to participate in all of the auctions on your website, or enable this option only for a specific auction. So. Let's see first how to configure the fee for all auctions. Let's go to the dashboard. Yip, Auctions, General, Auction Options. And we're going to scroll down and enable this option. Ask fee payment before bidding. Once we do this, this field appears where I can enter the amount I want users to pay as a fee to participate in the auctions. I'm going to just set a symbolic fee of $5 and I'm going to save. So since this is a global rule, all of the auctions on my shop have the required $5 fee that I have just configured. And any user that tries to place a bid will be asked to pay the fee first. Let's see how it works on my site. We're going to select one of these auctions. Once we're in the auctions page, if we scroll down, we can see this message right here that notifies the user that all participants must pay a non-refundable fee of $5 to place bids. If I try to place a bid without paying that fee, I get this message, pay the fee. And here it says to participate, you must pay a non-refundable fee of $5. Then you'll immediately be able to bid. And if I click here, I'm going to be redirected to the checkout page to pay for that fee. Now, what if we want to disable the fee in one of the auctions or maybe ask for a higher fee than the one we set as a global rule? As I mentioned before, global rules can be overridden in this individual auction type products okay let's see how to do that we're going to go back to the dashboard i'm going to click here on products and i'm going to select the auction that i was just in the development job auction so right here under product data auction i'm going to scroll down and here in advanced options i'm going to find all the options to override the plugins general settings okay Right here, the second option is override fee options. So if I enable this, I'm overriding the option that we configured before in the plugins dashboard. Right now, if I leave this as it is, I'm basically overriding the global rule to add a fee to participate in the auction. So anyone would be allowed to place a bid in this specific auction without paying a fee. But what we're going to do is enable this next option, ask fee payment before bidding. And we're going to enter $10 as a fee amount instead of $5, which is the global rule. So I'm going to update this there. Back to the side. I'm going to refresh there. So now the message says that the fee is $10 instead of $5, which is the global rule. And if I try to bid, the message says to participate, you must pay a non-refundable fee of $10. Now, just to show you, we're going to go back to the shop and I'm going to click on any of these auctions. So you can see that the global rule remains the same. The global rule is that users have to pay a fee of $5 in order to participate in the bid. Let's add any amount here to try and place a bid. You see, I get the $5 fee message again because this auction follows the global rule. And 
if I click here on pay now, we are redirected to the checkout page where we have to pay for that fee first in order to participate in the auction. Okay guys, that's how you can request the payment of a fee with our plugin. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please give this video a big thumbs up and we'll meet again for our next video.